Google Ads has just released an update which takes artificial intelligence to a whole new level. An extremely crazy update in my opinion which literally changes the game for e-commerce brands and in this video I want to break this update down for you step by step so you understand exactly what this update is, how it works and most important of all how it affects your own e-commerce brand. But the update that I'm talking about is this one right here where now Google Ads is introducing augmented reality and other virtual reality features directly into your Google shopping listing. Now, there's a lot of information here regarding this update, but I've already read through this. I've dissected it down for you. So first things first, what you need to understand is that with this update, you now have the ability or at least shoppers have now the ability to directly try on the product that they're trying to wear. Here's exactly what I mean. So for example, if it's some kind of red lipstick, a person is looking to wear on their lips or they're looking to purchase. Well, now with this argument, in reality and virtual reality updates now google gives them the ability to try it on literally by clicking a simple button on the top right which can be found on your google shopping listings it might not be available for a lot of your products right now but you can basically click that button and then images come up with visual generalizations of that product in effect as we can see here different skin toned women different types of women from different races they're all getting shown wearing this specific shade of lipstick and that's not all because now you can do the same thing with clothing for example if you're wearing or if you're selling some certain types of shirts you can now showcase your shirts on different sized women and just showcase how it looks even on different colors of women but if you thought that was all well you're in for a big surprise because now this goes far beyond just clothing or just things you can wear on your body or on your lips this now goes into actual products you can purchase such as for example this armchair right here you can literally with this update move that chair around and see it from all sides and angles and this is basically a 3d view of the product not only with the armchair but the shoes as you can see here you can zoom in on the shoe you can zoom out you can move it around as you like just to get a better idea of what the product is and how it works but this is an absolutely insane update and this kind of was done for a few different reasons in my opinion again first major reason why this was probably done was Google is now trying to give more of a seamless experience to the users using Google to shop because right now it's sort of like a little black and white approach to these product listings where you just have the product there and you can either like that product from first glance or you don't have to like that product you can click on the other products which come nearby this in my opinion has never really given users a full on direct first glance into your product of course they can go on your product page they can go on your landing page and then understand your product in greater detail however it's all about making things more efficient for the user so they know from first glance if they want the product or not second reason why i believe google is introducing this update is because now this is going to reduce the number of total questions a product gets because it's hard to answer a question like for example would this red lipstick look good on a black skin toned woman i believe this kind of update is going to reduce the total number of questions which users have and as a result again make things more efficient but this is also ultimately going to reduce the total number of returns which I believe the main goal was with this update because keep in mind majority of the returns and they even talk about this right here if we just do a quick search for the keyword returns we can see that about 55 percent of surveyed online apparent sh apparel shoppers have returned an item because it looked different on them than they expected and they literally say our suite of augmented reality tools give shoppers more insights into how products will look on them or in their space helping them ultimately make more confident decisions so ultimately this update is going to be very beneficial for your e-commerce brand because google is on your side it wants you to face lesser number of returns it wants you to have more happy customers and nobody likes dealing with returns believe it or not even though users want their money back the process of getting that money back is difficult users would rather keep your item they would rather be satisfied with it so i truly believe this update is going to make the shopping experience overall less stressful which means more users and more customers now interacting with your ads 
but most important of all this entire approach is going to add a sense of relevancy to your strategy so no more with a user clicking on your ad expecting a brown colored shirt but then ending up on a product listing page where the shirt is maybe not even a shirt it's a sweater or it's a hoodie it's helping your brand add a lot of relevancy to your product and as a result make the entire process seamless but now most mm -hmm. important of all, how do you apply this to your own e-commerce brand? What are these steps we're already taking for the brands we handle under my Google Ads agency? Which, by the way, if you run a brand doing $50,000 or more per month in revenue, you need just a little bit of extra help scaling your brand to the next level. Go on to my website at yourmarketing.com and schedule a free call with me to see essentially how we can work together and make that happen. But the first and foremost thing we are doing to kind of play along with this update is now we are getting the brands we work with to add even higher quality product images and not just product image from one side or one angle for example if they're selling this kind of chair we're getting them to add a photo from all sides and all angles including the bottom and the top because this directly makes it eligible to showcase in a 3d view now exactly how to show up your product images in a 3d view like this google has not made that clear as of yet it's still more in the process of getting incorporated but i truly believe having a product image from all sides and angles is going to be the first step to make even your brand eligible for a program like this. But in addition to that, clearly with this update, Google is telling us that they prefer high quality brands, which not only provide higher quality product images from all sides and angles, which make the shopping experience seamless, but also they're providing different sizes. They're providing different variations with different colors. So now users can have more options to choose from. And keep in mind, having options with Google Ads is a good thing because every single option, for example, a different shade of lipstick, every single option acts as its own individual product. And the more products you have a ranking in the top five and the top 10 product listings, the more sales your brand will eventually get. But besides that, we're ensuring the after sale experience is also just as good. We're ensuring that the product titles, Google Merchant Center doesn't have any types of product disapprovals, policy violations etc also incorporating high quality things such as these reviews quality store badge so on and so forth so anything and everything we can do to add a little bit of authority within the product listing to make our brand stand out is what we are doing 40 brands we handle which again if you run a brand doing 50,000 or more per month in revenue you need just a little bit of extra help scaling your brand to the next level go on to my website at yourmarketing.com and schedule a free call with me to see how we can essentially work together and make that happen but I want you to check out this case study next of a brand where we're starting to apply similar tactics like this right here mentioned in this video to scale that to multi seven figures.